Hey guys, welcome back to Dawn Rule 16. I am your host, Javon, and today we're back with a brand new little video. I'll just be showing you guys today how to connect your PS4 controller to your PC so you can actually run Tears of Arise on it. I have been getting a bit of comments about this on the channel, so I decided, meh, I'll show you guys. So I use this software called SCP Toolkit. You'll simply hit the download button. I'll leave a link down in the description below with just the setup that you can just click on. So I'm going to go to it. It's very simple to install. You just double click and install drivers and it'll come on instantly I'm not gonna go through all of that so once we're here I actually already have my PS4 controller plugged in I'll simply click on this and hit install now what this does is basically it sets it up so that it's it's like an Xbox 360 controller which is very reliable so I always keep it that way so we just let that install real quick and then I'll show you Tales of Arise running on it and we'll end it there. This is a very short video as I do. I just try to show you guys how to get it running really quickly and then we move on from there. But there you go. As you can see, it's going to come up now. Boom. There it is. Okay, so it's plugged in port 1 now. So now it has the feeling of an Xbox 360 controller. Um, you can change it. I wouldn't recommend it. So I'll leave it like that. And then I'll simply go over to Tales of Arise now wherever you have it in the download folder you launch Tales of Arise and boom you have your controller working for you I Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Like, please give a like, comment, subscribe, and stick around for more of it content. We do very short videos here just to get the game working. There's not much to it. Um, yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Once again, please give a like, comment, subscribe, and stick around for more of it.